Alrighty, yo. I'm gonna show you this book. Oh, I do have this. I think it's written sort of sort of words I don't recognize. Oh my gosh, it's a book, and not just any book. A golly, where did you find this? Somewhere in the barrens. Oh, we found it in a safe, right? Tap tap. Is that so? In that case. Oh shit. The voice of the computer is the author. And that's why he does all of this impossible shit, isn't it? In that case, I have... I know what I have to do now. I need to borrow this journal for a bit, okay? I gotta translate it. Oh, cool. Might take a while, though. That's fine. Ah, uh, excuse me. I look really tired. A little, yeah. No worries. I have a guest room in the attic up down the hall. If you want, go take a nap. A cat nap! Poor Nico. This, this is the kind of injustice that cat girls face every day. Do not be racist to the cat girls. Or the cat boys, for that matter. Any sort of cat person, regardless of cat gender. It's a stack of blank papers. Boxes full of manuscripts. A book on the ground. But she b deeply believed in the multiverse theory. Regarding alternate dimensions, she likened the probability to rolling of a dice. I guess that's why she's got a dice for a head. Recently, I found that theory easier and easier to believe, but I could not describe it very well back then. Nevertheless, oh, sorry, the mouse cursor's in there, isn't it? After all, it felt only right to honor this way. There are six. Which one did you encounter? What? Bookworm. What? There are six? Wait, what? Is she different from, like... Is she different? Has anybody else played this game? Is she different when you play with, like... When, like, do different people encounter different things? That's spooky. I'm a little tired from walking. Is it alright if I take a nap? Yep. I guess that would have been a good time to end the last video, but I didn't know we were gonna do that. Aw. Hold up. Gotta get pixel perfect. I should probably just reset where I recorded. I figured this game would save my window position. But it's, I guess, dead center probably every time. He's got, like, Nickelodeon parents. They don't actually have a face. What the heck is that? What? What am I seeing here? <gasps> oh. Fug. That's not good. Okay, still got it. Hey, tap tap? I guess you saw my dream? Yeah. It was... It's okay, buddy. Come on, let's go. Did you get that book translated? <gasps> oh. Oh, she just changes faces when she moves around. Okay, never mind. I thought she was like five die person today or something. Hey, yeah, had a good nap? Goody! I finished translating the journal, by the way. Oh, that was fast. Well, you're out for a while. Anyway, this journal looks like it might be meant for Tap Tap. Sure, take a look for yourself. Greetings, Tap Tap. If you can read this, it means you're near the tower. The tower is the domain of an elusive entity. Uh-oh, we're in Star Trek land now. This being is connected to the world. For now, we can think of it as the spirit of the world. There's no physical form, but it can communicate through computers and other machinery. Oh, so it's the spirit of the world, not the author. You know who I'm talking about, of course. When you first arrived here with our savior, there's no doubt that it contacted you right away. Through its own means, the entity will guide the both of you to the tower. The entry room is at the tower's base. Not only do you need the sun there, we also need three pieces of the previous sun. The savior will not be able to do anything there. You tap tap on the other hand. Look at the pattern on the floor. Do as it says. The window will be gone, so you need to bring it back. Is that, is that all? Guess you don't know what happened to those. Nope. I wonder what window is supposed to mean. Oh well, I guess tap, tap will have to figure out that one. It was made by three pieces of the previous sun. I only have this sun. Oh, of course. That just means you need things that contain yellow phosphor. They glow for a long time. Oh, I do have a picture of amber 
And a feather. They're both glowing yellow. Aw, just two? Here, you can have this then. Oh, he's so cute. Um, oh, she's doing a little PC sign. That looks... Try to do that with your hand. That is like... That is ow. Oh, it looks like me, right? Mm -hmm. Now you have a little keepsake from the library. Thank you. No problem. I guess you're all set. Good luck now. I guess we have to go there and freaking close the window? Because that's what the, the thing... Wow. Okay. Huh? Oh, he's hungry. Do you remember where the cafe is? Yeah. Oh, good. That's good as well. I'm a little hungry. Actually, I'm really hungry. I haven't eaten things since I got here. Is it okay if we go get some food? I hope they have pancakes. Yeah, pancake, er... <laughs> the cafe was way upstairs. Or up the escalator. Elevator. Whatever. The, the up-go box. I know words. I know all of the words. I have the best words. All right. Another awkward trip up the awkward Vader. I guess I should check out that die. Mm hmm. Safe place to go, you know, get some pancakes. You know, there's some horrible, like, death blocks, but just walk around the horrible death blocks. It's not a big deal. Pancakes. Give me the pancakes, my friend. Wait, I want to see die. A die with glowing dots. It's a glowing amber with a black clover inside. Oh, hey, you're back. Did you manage to fix the elevator? Mm-hmm. Tap Tap and I went to the surface already, and... Well, I remember there, there's a cafe here. Do you have pancakes? We sure do. Wait, I don't have any money. Maybe I can help you wash dishes or something? Oh, no, no. What's on the house? At least I can do for a savior, right? Here, why don't you take a seat? I'll go fry some up for you. Pancakes. What is this music? Okay, no, it's supposed to be soothing. It sounded like horror music for at the start there. I was like, oh god, what's happening? These pancakes are so good. Thank you so much. No problem. You look really hungry. Yeah, I thought this was something this would be my last chance to eat something before I got in the tower. Ah, oh, gotcha. So I guess pancakes are your favorite food? Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, almost. My favorite food in the world is a special pancakes my mama makes. She likes to stick hazelnuts and grind them up into the batter. Oh wow, that sounds amazing. They taste amazing. She always made them when I was feeling sad, or lonely, or... Mama. Oh, I really miss her. I just... I had a bad feeling all of a sudden. Am I even here to save the world? People have been saying the sun won't fix everything. I don't know why I'm here. I just want to see my mama again. Oh, uh... There, there. It's gonna be okay. I'm sure you'll be able to save the world. You're a tough kid. You managed to get this far already, right? Yeah, but... You'll get to go home afterwards, right? Right. Hey, want some more pancakes? It's okay. I'll be fine. So, yeah. Thanks for coming by. Mm-hmm. <laughs> thanks for listening. And for the pancakes. No problem. Good luck. Pancakes! Very good achievement. Pancakes make the world go round. Alrighty. I love when games have little stylistic flourishes that like repeat a bit, like I guess I can't show you here. But the you know, you see the little light bulb in the eyes, even in the transition things. Just nice little touches. Anything that you do reasonably often and is very unique is going to stick in players' mind a lot. Like, um, like that Metroid um, item get sound. In my opinion, you want to try to have like some kind of trademark like that and stick it in your game. Mm-hmm.
Alrighty. Off we go to the tower. Oh boy. I guess we must be pretty close to the end. Maybe, I mean, maybe. I, I don't know. Maybe I have to come back after the tower. I guess I really don't know. Because then... There was that thing. Okay, Nico. We'll be, we'll be back in a sec. Actually, I hate to cut it so short, but... I got a feeling the next one's going to be the finale. So, we're going to cut it here, and... Next time, we will enter the frickin' tower.